Hello, Sunshine. We're back again at the 2015 Network Journal's 25 Most Influential Women in Business. My name is Dr. Stacey N.C. Grant, and I'm joined here by Ms. Sharon Contreras for a superintendent in Syracuse, New York. We are so excited to be able to honor you today. We're excited that you are doing the work you are in education. Please tell us what has inspired you to be an educator and to do your work. You know, I was inspired by my eighth grade English teacher, Mrs. Doris Hargrove. She was the only African-American teacher I ever had, and she was phenomenal. And I decided I wanted to be an English teacher. Absolutely. And when you hear about her story and the fact that you haven't let just a little inconvenience of not hearing the way we all hear stop you, what made you so resilient despite the odds? I just feel like you have to be an overcomer. And I decided when I lost my hearing, I would not let it stop me. And help it, in fact, it helps make me a better superintendent because I can relate to so many children who have disabilities of different kinds. That is awesome. You can see why Ms. Contreras is being honored today as one of the 25 most influential black women in business. We salute you for your work and we pray for continued success in all that you do educating our community. Thank you so much. Stay tuned to TNJ.com. You never know who else will drop by the red carpet. Hello, Sunshine. It's me, Dr. Stacey N. C. Grant, back again on the red carpet at the 2015 Network Journal's 25 Most Influential Black Women in Business. And I'm standing here with one of our distinguished honorees. We are so excited to be able to honor you and the work that you do. Can you introduce yourself to our audience and tell them a little bit about who you are and what you do? Sure. Uh, Allison Hughley, I lead measurement and analytics at Weber Shanwick, a leading global PR agency. Awesome. She makes that sound so simple. So in the world of PR, I understand you've been recognized time and time again. You're a trailblazer. You're one of the outstanding women of power in PR. What was your inspiration for getting in this career? Um, actually, I came to PR through a non-traditional path. I came through data and research. And as communications have changed, the importance of data and analytics to what we do has become uh, increasingly important to driving the business. And I've been fortunate to be able to ride that wave and help to advance the work that we're doing at Weber Shanwick. That is awesome. Well, we're excited that she's here. We thank you for the way that you get the story out. That is very important. Continued success to you, and thank you for being a part of our 2015 class, 25 Most Influential Black Women in Business. Thank you so much. Stay tuned, everyone. Hello, Sunshine. It's me, Dr. Stacy N.C. Grant, back again on the red carpet for the 2015 25 Most Influential Black Women in Business. And I'm joined here today by another one of our distinguished honorees who's being recognized for her work in our community. So this is an exciting moment in time and space. But before we get there, just introduce yourself to our audience and tell them a little bit about what you do. Okay. My name is Allison Moore. I'm a uh, Associate General Counsel and Managing Director at J.P. Morgan. Um, I support one of our financial service products at J.P. Morgan. I also manage a group of attorneys there um, outside of the firm. I'm very active in mentoring. I'm a Brooklyn native. I still live in Brooklyn, have always you know, benefited from the benevolence of others, so I like to pay it forward. That is awesome, but she's just so modest because of what I understand. She created this opportunity that she now holds. You went out there and made the job happen. Describe what it took for you to have that kind of ingenuity in pursuing this particular path. You know, I feel like I'm just surrounded by very strong women, and I see when you step out from the ordinary path, a lot of good things can happen for you. So um, I was fortunate enough to be invited to an event where the CEO of my company was speaking, he made the pitch to the audience, if you're interested in working at the firm, come talk to him, and I did. So it, it definitely paid dividends for me to go over there, and I've been at J.P. Morgan for almost seven years now and have had a great experience. That is wonderful. So it just takes you stepping out, and sometimes just on faith. So congratulations to you. Thank you for tuning in to TNJ.com. Stay tuned. You never know who else might drop by the red carpet. 